Hey, what's up guys, Nuno here. In this video, I'll show you how you can get from this into this. So basically, we will have higher resolution displacement maps inside Lumion using the default ones. But since the default ones that Lumion has has about 2K resolution, we will get from polygon side textures that has about 8K resolution. And so it will be much better quality. We don't need to get new displacement maps. We just need the textures of uh, diffuse and normal and gloss. And we will use the displacement maps that Lumion already has. And by the way, before we get started, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell button to get notified when I publish my new videos. And also, if you want to get my Megascan scene that I made in Lumion using some displacement maps, Megascan assets, Lumion assets, so I'm sharing that scene on Gumroad and I'll post the link in the comments below this video. Okay, so here we are inside Lumion and I will select a material that has a displacement map. I'll go to Outdoor, Bricks and page 4 and I already selected this one it's Bricks Industrial Pastoral Red and you see that it has 2K so it has 2K resolution and it looks like this okay so it's fine but it could be much better see when you are close it's, nah, it's very blurry so what we'll do is since this texture is from Polygon well, you need a Polygon account, but uh, you can go to their site and you just type industrial pastoral red and here you'll see the same material, okay? And when you click it, you see that it has the 2K resolution, but if you go all the way, 4K, 6K, high res. So this high res is 8K, so it's much, much bigger than the, the, the one that is inside Lumion. And here we'll just select the diffuse, the gloss and normals. This is all we need. We don't need the displacement because the displacement is already inside this material. So we're going to use this material as a base. So let's deselect this and just press download. Okay, now let's import the textures that we downloaded inside Photoshop. And in the previous video, I showed you how you can make PBR materials to import inside Lumion. So now let's do the same. I will just take the gloss map and put inside alpha channel of the normal map. And I will invert the green, uh, press Ctrl I to invert. And now we can save, in the previous video I, I told you that you can save as target and then 32 bit, but this is much heavier than another file format. and which I'll show you now that you can download, which is NVIDIA Textures Tools for Adobe Photoshop. You can download and it will allow you to export as DDS file format. This will be much faster to import inside Lumion and then in general inside Lumion everything will run better. So I already installed here. What we can do is just save and we go to DDS here and just we save like this. We select the 32 ARGB to save with the alpha channel and press save. This here will, will take much more time to save comparing to Targa, but again, it will be worth inside Lumion because it will take much less time inside Lumion. Now we go inside Lumion and on this side, so we had this is the one by default, and on this side we are going to select the same material, go to outdoor, bricks, here, select this one and double left click it to open the properties and we are going to select our own map. So here to the diffuse, we're going to select this 8K one that we downloaded and we will do the same with the normal map. Okay, so we have this DDS, we import it. So you see how fast it was and now let's compare one and another so now we have this one if you look close you can see all the details of this look at this of this brick these details if you go to the same one we have almost nothing it's like everything is blurry so we cannot see all of those details 
and but we still have the displacement working so if i go here again to the properties of the material see if i see this displacement is working perfectly fine so this is a trick to get displacement maps with very high resolution that Lumion doesn't have. I hope you find this video useful and by the way, if you still want to get this scene, I'll leave the links in the comments below this video. See you in the next ones.